Okay, so I have shared that I went to the pro-life event here in Colorado Springs. Um, and Grace Grace was one of the organizations there. And um, my channel is mostly about helping women to be able to be um, mothers, wives and mothers, ideally, right? Um, but even if you don't have a husband or you're a single mom, you can still make it on your own. So how do we do this? We really need the church. The church is where you're going to find a lot of support. Um, <clears throat> not just financially, but physically, community is going to be a huge support. I did this on my own without anyone really telling me. I just started going to church, put my kids in Awana youth group, had a mobs class, had a class for um, when you have teenagers, um, my kids had, um, camps, they had, um, mission trips. So I kind of just leaned on the community, um, in my time, my time, my spare time. I mean, not that I had a lot of spare time, but, um, I think homeschooling with all the resources to help me homeschool all the books. Um, I went to a convention. I had, uh, support groups there. Um, in the homeschooling community, I think that's what really helped me because I was able to use my time to be able to figure out where resources were um, to help me raise my kids. Um, I used the city of Concord. There was a lot there with free swim lessons, scholarships, and Boy Scouts. Um, what else? Sports. Yeah, my kids were in basketball, soccer. Um, having the extra time to be very involved in your kids' lives, are that's going to make the difference. So homeschooling, where I educated myself, um, I was also educating my kids and myself. So that was a huge help for me. And just having the community. Um, I went into the community. I had a mom-to-mom -mom group, too. I did not have the community come to me. I seeked the community and that's what helped me the most. So I'll be going into this some more, but find community.